All righty, here we go. Got a big one coming up here. On your left, that's Chance Marsteller, four-time PA State champion. Just finished his redshirt season for Oklahoma State. He's taking on Penn State's Jason Nolf in the red singlet there, who just came off a monster redshirt season of his own. Actually beat NCAA finalist Brian Robuto. We're all underway here, and we're going to see a lot of offense. Both these guys very offensive, especially Nolf. High output, a lot of attacks. You're going to see Marsteller. Going to look to get to his underhook. He's got great defense. Both these guys super hard to score on for, for different reasons. Marsteller positionally really tough, and Nolf's just a great athlete, good flexibility. He can scramble well, um, but not particularly versed in freestyle. Um, and so we'll see if being a novice in the international styles is, is comes into a role here, it comes into effect against someone who's fairly seasoned, uh, like Chance Marcel. He's got Fargo titles. He's uh, made the Cadet World team, been in the Cadet World semi. So he's definitely got the edge in freestyle experience. And they're going to say pass, passive warning on Nolf. One more of those. He'll go on the shot clock. Now upper body ties there. There's another shot from Nolf. Let's see, Marsteller getting to that underhook right where he likes to be. Goes to single, switching to a double. Now looking to come out the back door up to his feet. And he's going to get the finish, the finish given. And it's going to go 2-0 for Marsteller as he's looking to lace him over. Nolf holding tough. And they're going to go one, and they're going to go one on the, I guess, a push, push out. So, Mark, uh, Nolf would have been better served just to kind of stay low there. When he kind of got crawling on his hands, Marcel was able to drive him forward. And that's what we're talking about, just being a little inexperienced, is we're seeing Nolf get in on a single leg. Good hips there from Marsteller. And now looking to pinch him over, can't get it. Now in a wizard seatbelt position. A minute left on the clock here in the opening period. Still 3-0 Marsteller. But Nolf in a position where he could potentially score here from the seatbelt. Now they're gonna come back up to the feet. Now he look, maybe look knee blast there, but Marsteller was ready. And now he's got a bailout, and there's a takedown for Nolf. Makes it a 3-2 score, Marsteller leading. Underhook left side for Chance Marsteller. Now he clears. And we'll see, it's a high pace first period. We'll see who that pace favors. Uh, Nolf, kind of known for his tank and just attacking consistently six, seven minutes, however long the match is. As time runs out, good first period. It's 3-2 in favor of Chance Marsteller. Thanks, man. All right, back underway. Second period has begun. There's a shot from space by Nolf. Now short offense here for Marcel. He goes to that front headlock. Squeezing it tight and they'll put it back up. 250 to go here in the second. And they exchange attacks. And now Nolf gonna throw it by. And he's gonna get two. Great takedown there. Good chain wrestling by Jason Nolf as he takes the lead 4-3.
Now he's looking for a gut. Marstell a little slow coming back to center. And there's a great single leg, but nice reattack from Marstell. Underhook left side. And there's a great single leg, Chandler Marsteller. Nolf trying to control that left hand of Marsteller as he's looking for that other leg. And that's interesting position, two held up by the judge. The chair doesn't make a, he white paddles it. They're gonna go nothing there. So they're not giving anything for Marsteller there. They're putting him back up. I don't, I don't understand that one. 4-3. So Nolf continues to lead. Great single leg by Nolf. He's got the angle wizard from Marsteller, but it's not going to stop him. Nolf up 6-3 now. Looking dynamite on his feet, getting angles. There's a shot attempt by Marsteller. Nolf continuing to attack. Both these guys attack. There's a double leg from Marsteller. Now 6-5. He's got a lace. Let's see if he can use it. Six five, one point match. Jason Nolf of Penn State continues to lead. Marsteller takes a look back at his coach. Again, a little slow returning to the center. Not sure, sure if he's starting to feel it a little bit. There's another single leg from Nolf. Pulls it up, trying to shelf it now up to his feet with it. Marsteller turns down. And nothing yet. They're still in a tripod position. Marsteller's strong here. Marsteller's still coming up. And he's trying to roll. What's the call here? Takedown. As Marsteller went desperation. And now 8-5, just 18 seconds to go. So Jason Knopf really in the driver's seat here, looking strong. Marcel are going to have one more opportunity here, maybe. He's going to need probably a takedown and a turn. Or Knopf's going to take this one. And Knopf drops right down to that single. Two and one, and there's the win. Nothing at the buzzer there, but an impressive 8-5 win for Jason Nolf. And he'll be wrestling in the semifinals later tonight. Check it over at the other side, guys.